Duke, Duke, Duke. Yes, yes. Tell us the story. Yes, tell us the story. All right, all right. You all know that story I told back in 1915, right? Yes, the one about Smudger. Yes, yes. We remember it. We remember it well. Also, Sir Hendel, I'm going to beat you with a belt after this. Wait, what? What the f- Hey, never mind. Let me tell you the real story of what happened. Oh, guy. Oh, man. I didn't get no ass last night. I couldn't. There was flower hookers to last night. God damn it. Uh, was Grandpa telling stories, goddamn stories again? Let me listen in, I'm bored as hell. You all remember the story about Smudger, right? Yes, yes! Well, there's some little details I left out. Smudger was going over an overhaul tonight. He was never turned into a generator. Oh, that's why we never see him out the side of the sheds. We thought he moved to the mining company. No, no, no. Oh, man. It's all wrong when I told you. Smudger was being rebuilt... To a standard gauge form, like Scarlowe, almost. Ah, oh, man. I was stupid back then. Ah, oh, man. His derails because he was not being good. His wheels would keep derailing. It was the rails and his wheels. Didn't get along very well. I suggested him to be rebuilt. Hey, Dirty, that's actually not a bad idea, you say. Hmm. Ah, oh, man. Yes, these accidents are getting out of hand. You say so. I was always stupid back then to think that it was in his fault. He said to me on the night of the accident, Hey, Dookie, I'm built into a tank engine just like you, Most. <laughs> I laughed. It was the best thing I ever seen. Him being built into a, in a tank engine version of me. He had to cross the old wire duct to get his load. And, um, well... Ooh, that's insane! Oh my god, what happened?! Tell us, Duke, tell us! Yes, I'm done, Tenor! Gee, for God's sake, Smudger was crossing an old wooden railway bridge. His designer screwed up his fault and... <sighs> he plunged over the edge of the sea, screaming and wailing a pathetic life. <sighs> he hit the ocean with a splash, being drowned to death in everything. <sighs> I was sad when he died. Oh, Duke, I know the story. Can I tell the rest? Sure. Well, after Smudger's death, I came to purchase Duke. Then, ugh, oh, man. Duke was crying in the shed. God damn it, it was always my goddamn fault. I couldn't. Uh, in my mind, before I get to the sad part, your railway was beautiful, guys. I'm glad I could visit it. Oh, thanks, Galloway. Yeah, thanks. You know, it kind of sucked back in the day when there was nothing moving. I happily took your trains back and forth to help you. So did Renaeus. And um, yes, it was kind of good. Ah, man, and you two came to the island, it was great. We had to rename you, though. <laughs> I remember your first day, Peter Sam. The cold wind broke in your funnel on the first day. Arrgh. And remember Edward, when he came in? I remember that. Great, now I'm gonna have a nap, Miss. Hey, uh, you all get the day off, but Duncan, you have a sleigh truck to deliver. Oh, son of a... Crap, uh, man, I'm on a... Are you scared, Duncan? I know, I'm shooken from Wheel of Funnels. Uh, 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 no, I'm not. Are you sure? No, uh, I got work to do. Bye! Is Duncan scared? Oh, man. That makes me quiver from smoke box a cab. Ugh. Well, let's, let's hope it goes through smoothly. <laughs> I can't get rid of that image of Smudger. Um, um, uh, 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 um, yeah, yeah, don't look down, don't look down. Just keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Um, uh, uh, uh what's that noise? Oh, okay, it's just, um, uh, I mean, you know what? Maybe that's Stoyle's bullcrap. Maybe Duke just told me that to scare me. Well, we had to go tonight on the old iron witch. We had to wait for our trucks first. Oh, crap. Uh, I shouldn't open my big fat mouth. Boom. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> guy, I'm so happy. I'm not scared. I'm so happy. I'm not scared. I am so screwed. I know it. I am so screwed. La la. I'm so screwed. I'm so. Oh yeah, I'm dead. There is no doubt about it. I am freaking dead. Um, um, um. Hello, hello, hello. Echo, echo, echo. Oh crap! Why did I have to stop on the bridge? Hello. Hello there. Hello? No, Duncan, don't be scared. Don't 
If you're scared, you're a flipping ghost. How am I not supposed to be scared right now? Duncan, will you shut up? I just want to say I'm sorry for my past mistakes. For everything, I'm sorry. For all the past mistakes I did. But, Duncan, I can tell you a secret where I am. Where? Where? I would love to know. I would love to have no part of the railway. I'm in an abandoned warehouse. Okay, I'll ask Toby if you can find it. Okay, bye. Oh, and by the way, you looked good in uh, Scarlet's form, just to, just to tell you that. Bye. Oh, let's go back, driver. Um, I don't have to tell the end what I just witnessed. Duncan raced back as far as he could and went to sleep tightly. Not until his driver and fireman went. You go there, Duncan? But no reply came from Duncan. But then, he opened his eyes to tell the engines what he'd heard. Just to make sure his drivers were not looking at him to hear him.